everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Chloe and I own the Etsy shop Chloe Louise Designs Co. If you're coming from my Instagram then you'll probably already know that I have been thinking about starting a YouTube channel. So I'm just doing it and I'm just going to get on with it and I hope you all enjoy my videos. I know it's probably going to take me a while to get the perfect videos but yeah I just thought I would do this in video is just going to be a bit of an introduction to the stickers that I sell in my Etsy shop. So the sticker kits, the icon stickers and a couple of other bits and pieces so I hope you like this video so to start with this is one of my full sticker kits this hasn't long been in the shop this is called cozy season it has got nine full boxes so we've got one extra if you're using it in the Erin Condren or any other vertical planners but you can obviously maybe like use this one as cut it up as a bit washy or something so this st sticker kit is perfect for autumn as you see you've got all the pumpkins and little brush Stick, all perfect for art the autumn month and all the orange and red colours. So if you go on to the second page, we've got six flags up here and then we've also got some heart checklists. So then these ones are the full long heart checklist and these ones are the short heart checklist. Over here we have got some hexagons which can be used with an icon on top just if you're doing a little bit of a simple as write down of what you've done. Like if you've just gone shopping you could just use the a shopping icon next to that one and just write shopping next to it it's perfect for that and then we've got icons over here so it's functional some heart hearts down here and then also some bows because who doesn't like any bows got a weekend banner down here for everyone that likes to use a weekend banner on their weekly spread got some deco for if you like using those i know i do in my weekly spreads so i use them every week and also we have got some script down here as well so we've got work, me time, family time, duvet day, sick day, Netflix binge, movie night, pay day and date night. So if we move on to the next page, this is page three. Please ignore this up here. I think I spilt my drink on it, but this is my personal sticker kit. And I think I forgot to mention, this is actually on the premium matte sticker paper, but I am going to show you some of the stickers on the regular removable matte sticker paper. You'll probably notice that a lot of my stickers that I've got here are on the premium matte. So if you are wanting the premium matte sticker paper, you need to go on to the upgrade section of my Etsy shop to upgrade grade the sticker kit source paper because it is a lot more expensive but the reason why I've got a lot of these already printed on and cut onto the paper is due to that paper being my favourite paper that I like to use in my planner. So on this sheet we're on page three now so we've got the ombre heart checklist so checklist boxes and you've actually got nine of those so we've got lots and lots to use. I only really use one of these every week. On the page four now you've got some headers you've got today do clean this week important dinners habit goals and work and down here you've got some appointment labels i do like to use quite a lot of these in my planners and normally stick an icon on top of this bit as well i was actually thinking about getting rid of this little icon that are on there so then they can just be you with an icon on top then down here we've got some habit trackers and we've got some bill dues and then we've got some little bow appointment labels now we're on on sheet five so we've got some half boxes and then we've got some quarter boxes and then we've got some rounded quarter boxes and then we've got some glitter labels and on this page we've got some date covers some wash washi strip these sticker kits are actually perfect for the erin condren and also the aurora estelle as i don't actually support erin condren anymore due to everything that's been happening with her lately so i do don't use my erin condren planner anymore and i use my aurora estelle planner instead so now we've got some we've got one weekly full box and then we've got some washi strip down here so that is the full sticker kit so these are if you are buying these in the shop i'm sure these are 11 pound 50 but then if you're wanting to upgrade to the premium matte sticker paper it does cost a bit more bear that in mind next we'll move on to another sticker kit this one i actually brought out during spring my pr girls actually requested this one but i just wanted to show you this one due to it me having the glitter headers already printed and cut as i was going to use this in my planner but i think i'll wait till next year now to use it in my planner 
planner with it not really being spring anymore. So these are the matching glitter headers. All sticker kits have matching glitter headers which you can add on so they, they do cost a little bit more. They're £1.75 extra so I don't think it's that much more but if you want to upgrade these to the premium matte sticker paper which these are, this one is printed and cut on then it does cost a little bit more. So this kit is a full kit again so it's just the same format. Full boxes, all the flag clay, deco, icons, weekend banner and also the full box checklist, all the head headers and appointment labels, habit trackers, bill dues and then also all the boxes and labels and the date boxes, date covers, washi and the weekly full box. Alright so that one's just the same format as the other one. All of my full sticker kits do have the same format so you don't need to worry about it coming any different to that. Next we'll move on to this one it's a mini sticker kit and this one is printed onto the removable matte sticker paper so you'll probably notice a huge difference with the print in quality that's why that is one of the main reasons why I prefer to use the premium matte sticker paper in my planner but obviously I want to keep the removable matte sticker paper in my shop as an affordable option. I have been debating whether to get rid of it and just do remove just do premium matte but this sticker paper does seem to be the most popular in my shop because it's like more affordable so I do you want to keep it so with the mini sticker kit they are only three pages long so they're not six pages like the other one but they do have the front page so you've got the nine full boxes and this one is actually a succulent sticker kit so this one did come out around summertime I'd say not that long ago really but if we move on to sheet two we've got our half boxes here so you don't have as many as the full sticker kit and then you've got the quarter boxes rounded quarter boxes and glitter labels and you've got two thin strips of washi and then if we move on to the last page you've got a weekly full box we've got an ombre heart checklist and then we've got some date covers some flag some checklist flag so a bill june habit tracker some more flags so you've got six the same as the other one the other sticker kit and you've got some and we've got some headers some both appointment labels and a weekend banner so you can still do a full weekly spread with the mini sticker kits and these ones are actually only £6.50 in my shop but obviously if you want to upgrade to the premium mat as I said before it does cost a bit more so let me move this planner out the way and we will go on to some more so I just wanted to flip through some icon stickers I've organised them because if you know me and my Instagram I do like to be very organised so I've organised them onto premium mat and removable mat these are the autumn bucket list icons I do also have them on the removable mat just because I wanted to show you the quality difference so I'm hoping you can see the difference with hat and this is why I prefer this stick of paper over the removable mat so if you do want this one add it to your basket well there's them ones they're perfect for Halloween and then if we go through all the removable mat ones first these are my podcast icons so you do get absolutely loads I try and fit as many as I can on the sheet just so then they will last you a long time and these are the clean bathroom ones the reason behind these ones where why I added these to the shop was because I'm really into Mrs Hinch at the moment and I do like my house nice and clean these ones are declutter who doesn't like a nice tidy house these ones are the fairy tale bow clips I love these and they're perfect for if you just don't have an icon sticker for something or you just want to use them to decorate with. Next one's a coffee cup. I absolutely love coffee. I have one every day. And then these are planner time icon stickers. So these can be used for marking in your planner when you've actually planned your weekly spread or planning to. Now let's move the premium matte icons. These ones are the fairy tale washi tips. I've printed and cut these for myself just because I I've resubscribed to the Simply Gilded washi box. So I will be using these in my planner to mark when that's came. These ones are my Aurora style icons. This one is in the Enchanted Indigo colorway. And then this one is in mint green 
which a mint green one hasn't actually came out yet but I did want to include this one because it's a gorgeous colour and then this one is in blush pink so they're perfect for if you do have an Aurora style for using them to mark in your planner when you've planned your weekly spread or even just to plan even just to put in any planner when you've planned your weekly spread it doesn't have to be a raw style you can just use it because you think they're pretty and these ones are my printer icons i do use these quite a bit because i i've got orders that i need to print every week these ones are mortgage slash rent so if you've got mortgage or rent that you need to pay and you want to put these in your planner as a bit of a reminder and these ones are the coffee cups again but these ones are they're on the premium matte sticker paper so if you grab them ones and obviously obviously hopefully see the difference of the quality these ones are my hoover icon stickers i'll be using these a lot with my mrs hinch obsession and then these ones are my date night icon stickers but they can also be used for girls night or any kind of night which involves alcohol or flowers right let's move on to these so these ones are all on the premium mat because I've actually printed and cut these for my own planner to use in September. But these are, this one is my September hexagon cover page. So it does come with the big hexagon. This one has been designed for the Erin Condren pages. But seeing as though I don't use my Erin Condren anymore, but I do really like using this kit. So I have actually made it work in my planner and I'll show you that in a minute. And then on this one on this page you do actually have a blank one which goes underneath this one so then you can't see any of the detail underneath when you don't have to use a massive load white out and then that kit actually does have the add-on deco sheet which you can add on if you like using deco around it i do like using these all the time i just think it's just something extra that makes it look pretty and this is one of my monthly sticker kit this one is actually designed to fit into the erin condren but obviously with me not using that one anymore i have been having to make it work in my aurora style which is a slightly different size i'm having to cut a little bit off the side when i'm sticking these down just to bear in mind if you are using an aurora style planner but on this page this is a four page monthly sticker kit and it's printed on the premium matte sticker paper so it's got obviously got september there but these kind of join together but obviously you're going to use them separately separately across the page so you've got obviously sunday to saturday but i do also have a little strip which is an add-on where you can get the monday start but if you prefer to start your monthlies on a monday rather than a sunday so on this page we've obviously got some flag we've got some boxes and we've got some bow labels we've got some ombre checklists boxes labels date flag so i have put 31 of these in just so then i don't need to keep going on every single month and adding more and more i just thought it'd be easier to have it have 31 of them in every single sticker kit We've got some lots of bill dues on there because who doesn't like a bill during the month because i don't and we've got some rounded quarter boxes regular quarter boxes and then these ones are technically half boxes if you're comparing them to actual box size like that's the box size it's half of that and got some icons some bows and some hats and on this page we've got some washi so this bit can actually go on the top strip for if there's any dates of the month that are actually in that month cover that bit and then this strip of washi actually goes on your sidebar if you wish to use it like that obviously you can use the check boxes or anything else that you want to use on that bit don't have to use this bit of washi but we've got some labels here appointment labels here as well and also all of the events for the month i do include all of these i always include my birthday because because who doesn't like to mark that it's their birthday on that month and then there is two spare ones for if you want to 
I don't eat others, but some t in some of the months there is more of these that are blank. It just depends on what events there are. So that's that one. And then before I go on to my planner, I do want to share with you my PR Girls freebies. These ones are my new freebies, seeing as though, as a lot of you might know, I did have to close the shop a couple of weeks ago due to all of my files getting deleted off the Silhouette software. So I have had to make some new freebies, but they absolutely love PR girls, absolutely love them. So these are the autumn freebies. So I got them to choose which full box they wanted and then I did all the colours to match them. So this one's Mona's and her Instagram is Mona underscore plans. And this one is Zoe. So that's her full box that she chose and then all these functionals. Her Instagram is actually my little planner life. So you can actually, you can use their, their codes in the shop to save you 10% off. So Zoe's code is Zoe10 and Mona's code is Mona10. Make sure you use their codes and also mention their names in the comment on the order to receive their freebie. Well, last of all, we'll have a little look at my planner. So this is my Aurora Estelle planner. This hasn't long arrived so I haven't actually done that much in it but this is in the colourway lilac daydream and I have chose the gold hardware so if we open it up as you can probably see there's nothing much going on over here I do need to find some items to go in here to decorate it and I do also want to put something here maybe like a little notebook or something for my new releases and then if we go over here I do have the dividers which I bought from the Aurora Style website but I do also have something else which I am going to include on top of this so this is actually what I bought on on Etsy, I'm just covering my address there. I ordered the dashboard and it does have Chloe Louise there in the gold foiling. I can't actually remember if I see this shop. I actually bought this, these from the shop Heather B. Co. So I'll have her link down below. She does do the personalised obviously and you can choose what colour hair you want in yours and also what size planner you want it for so I just need to punch these and then I can put them in and then I've also got this floral which I couldn't resist not buying because if you look they're like little Mickey Mouse heads of the flowers so I did have to buy that as well but I can't I don't really know where I'm going to put this one at the moment I might put it at the back just for now but yeah and they're just blank on the back so let's do a little flip through so like I said I've got the gold hardware this is an A5 wide planner which I think is perfect so like I showed you the before the hexagon sticker kit this is how I've made it work in my planner so I've used simply gilded washi and then I've Put, I've obviously whited out everything underneath and then put the Simply Gilded washi on and then I have stuck down the hexagon but I did put down the white one first so I made sure it was centre before I put the decorative one on top just because then you don't see the washi through the stickers but it is printed on the premium matte sticker paper as you'll know through this video that is my favourite sticker paper. We move on to the next page. I have started my August monthly. I obviously haven't finished it. So I do need to put my down my date flag and everything that I've done that month. But I have had to cut down slightly here and here. And I'm thinking about putting some washi up here just because it's not that tall as tall as the Erin Condren and then I did have to cut these a little bit and also the sidebar it was a little bit too long so this is my first week that I planned in this planner just to get you in frame so this week I did use my succulent sticker kit this was the full sticker kit and as you'll probably see I have used a lot of my own stickers 
and then also some other stickers which aren't from my own shop as I do like to support other shops as well so if you do want to see where some of these where some of these shop where some of these icons are from if you if I haven't shown them on this video then if you go onto my Instagram which is Chloe Louise Designs Co then I do have them tagged on the post yeah I did use gold foil in this way that way and this was last week I do need to put up a post about this I keep forgetting to put the post up but this week I did use the fun in the sun full sticker kit again on the premium matte sticker paper and lots of my own icons as well as other, I other icons from other shops and then I've used holographic foil which I do offer in my shop as well I offer foiled items so these bows if you can see them there bow headers they're from my shop and also the confetti overlay header overlays they're from my shop as well oh, yeah and that's all that I've done at the moment I am hoping to film a plan with me for this week I am hoping to get that up and done but yeah these are just the inserts from the Aurora Estelle shop which I did just buy with my planner as I thought it would probably be easier so it just goes all the way through the year and then I've not really got anything at the back I don't think no only thing that I keep at the back is the sticker kit that I have been using so I think that one was that's my monthly and that one's a succulent one so if you've got any spare sticker because on that I want to keep I do put them there before I put them into my little sticker book and then also I've got a shop villa beautiful pen if you are from my Instagram you'll probably seen that I did buy three of these in the different colors so I've got this greeny blue one purple one and a pinky coral one so if you want to check those out there is a post on Instagram I'll also link her down below as well. But now yeah, that's everything. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And I am hoping to get videos up re as regularly as I can. As I do work full time as well as owning an Etsy shop. But I am trying, I am going to be putting up plan with me videos maybe monthly plan with me videos if you want to see those and also new release videos so i'll show you the new releases so i will show you the new releases each week beyond the day that they've came out i'll put the video up so you can just go straight away and buy them if you are interested and then i was also thinking about doing a day in the life of an extra shop owner videos as well so you can see what actually happens behind the scenes but I am going to find that a little bit tricky with also working full time as I do usually during the week I do usually work on my orders of an evening after I've just done a full day at work so yeah hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one bye